Hey everybody, three guys, six beers. We're back at it in 2020. Happy New Year, everybody. Uh, we took a little hiatus, but you know, we're back at it. So today, what we're gonna do, since we had a little bit of a break uh, from doing videos, we've, mm -hmm. we've all had some beers that we've tried lately. So this is a, uh, what's come lately? Beers we've tried lately. Yeah, Here you go. There you go. That's the best way I put it. That's what it's going to be, so uh, the three of us are going to uh, take out a beer that we've had lately, and um, we're all going to try it, so uh, how are we going to do this? I'll just, I'll just, what do you guys know? All right, I'll go right, 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 It's mid-January, mid so we still had some Christmas sales left in the house. There you um, go. This is the uh, Shiner Holiday Cheer, and they are out of uh, Texas. Cool. So... Shiner. Probably one of the right. cities here in Ohio, right? Oh, well, I brought, boys, one of my favorite breweries, the Left Hand Brewery. I and love Left Hand Not the Brewery. right. Uh, not the right, the it's right. the left. Uh, and this is their uh, chai milk <coughs> stout. It's a nitro. Um, so Chai milk? Isn't that yeah. like the, the fancy stuff you Wait, get at like this Starbucks? Isn't the, no? This isn't the healthy beer tasting, is it? No. Chai's... Like no. future video coming, healthy yeah. beer. Okay. No, yeah. so um, it is Thanks a nitro. You. you know you're supposed to do a hard pour with these. But you hard pour that whole can into here? Yes. You don't okay. necessarily have to do that. So let me have. Oh, oh here. here. Cool. I'm going to show you my beer in a minute because uh, well, it'll be apparent when we get to it. So. All right. Cool. But I think you're going to like it. There you are, Jamie. Thank you, yeah. sir. All right. Oh, that's right. Oh, look at that. Oh, that cascading right, right there. Do that right. Put that sucker right there. Whoops, I almost Ooh, I like it. that. Look at that. Check it out. Ah. Oh, yeah. Look at that. Nice. Cool. Did it awesome. me one. Very cool. All right, sweet. All right, go ahead, one of y'all. All right. We're going to start with yours, TJ. You don't want to open up your beer yet? You don't want to break out your beer? You want to see it now? Of course. We got to have three beers, Whoa, right? Crazy thing. Ah, ah, look at this! <laughs> All right. Uh, so, look at this. Okay, wait a minute. Jamie had to show us off. Jamie had to show us off. Yes, and we're doing big boy glasses. We're doing big boy glasses. All right. <laughs> so. No wonder he didn't want to pull it yeah. out. What this is. I'm a quite embarrassed. I, I was yeah. just going to say, I'm a little I'm embarrassed. I'm not now. trying to embarrass you, actually. So, I was down at Lockport Brewing Company and um, picked this up. And I got thinking about it. As much as I'd like to try, I don't think I could drink this whole can in one setting. Although, I bet you could. You know, the thought of, you know, sitting here and drinking like that. But, okay. You look like a man. What this is, and I've had this beer already. This is probably, not probably, it is like right now my current favorite beer. Uh -huh. and, and I know you've had it too. Yes. So I mean this is unfair, yep. but I just wanted to share it. It's their Profound Warlock. So what's cool about this is, so it's a peanut butter coffee porter. Say that five times fast. But we know our friends M&H Beans, Mike and Hannah. Oh, yeah. uh, actually my neighbors are probably right over here. Who knows? Maybe they're looking out the window at us right now. Um, their coffee beans are used to make this beer. So that's pretty awesome. And so yeah, that's why is. I wanted to try it. Yeah. But of course I like the porters and the stouts and whatever. I freaking love this beer. It's I awesome. I haven't touched so, it yet. It's, no. I haven't tried it. I hope you guys like it. So, never opened up a can quite this big. So. I'm a little afraid of what's going on. I know, me too. Dude, that would be the best. <laughs> what, if it blew up all over here? Yeah. yeah. Love it. Oh, yeah. Katie's not going to be too happy. So. <laughs> Woo. Look at that go. Look at that. I don't know. I hope nobody's grading me on my pouring here. Are we only going to get that you much? Got, well, I'm probably going to give you more. Yeah, 18,000 <laughs> viewers looking at this. Yep. 18, That's much All better. right. There nice. There we go. All right. Actually, there is going to be more in here. Maybe I'll just take the rest of it myself here. Oh, boy. I'll give you guys. There is some more in here if you guys want it. I was trying to judge how much is All in right, here. Give me that can. i got to take a picture of this. There you go. That's cool, isn't yeah, it? Yeah. So, Lockport is just an absolutely awesome place. So, really like it. Um, love their beer. I also had, I'm trying to think of what the other one was that I had. Um, awesome beer, love it. So, want to get started? Yeah, we're who's gonna we starting with? We're gonna go with. Uh, well, let's start the order. We we, we uh, all right. Yeah, so, so, uh, so far left side, we got the Shiner. Perfect. This is the Holiday Cheer. All right. All right. Let's do it. Cheers, Cheers, boys. Cheers. All right. Ooh. 
I just wanted to it's tell you that there's a, there's a reason why there's a lot of this left in my fridge. Okay. <laughs> So, oh, <laughs> I don't even know what to think about that. I, so, I don't know what order our videos are going to come out in, but for all our friends out there in craft beer land, searching the interwebs for beer videos today, we actually just did a review of a homebrew beer um, that was given to me behind a dumpster at a local establishment. Uh, it sounds <laughs> a homebrew cool. Christmas video. beer. Homebrew Christmas beer. Mm -hmm. That homebrew Christmas beer was much better than this. I don't like this at all. Yeah, I'm going to be quick with this. Yeah. I'm going to vote because I just want to get over with this and get on to these better beers. Let's do it. I, think, I don't think This I is a half that. beer for me. I, I don't like it. Nope. I don't like it. That's why there was some left in my fridge. Um, I, I bet their other beers are good. But Joe, just, did you hear this? I don't like it. Did you hear what he's doing? So he's got the beer he doesn't like and he brings it. I've got the beer yeah. that I love. It was left in my fridge. <laughs> <laughs> you love you too, it was left there for a reason. Jeez, man. It's not good. Um, I'm going to jump in there. I'm going to go slightly better just because I want to credit the time that they put into it. I'm going to give them a one. It was my favorite. I, I think, I think I'm going to go one two. It tastes like cough syrup to me. I don't know if it's cough syrup, but I, I almost taste like pineapple. In it. Like, is there pineapple in it? <sighs> That's a great question. I, I like just it. don't know. So uh, Texas like peaches and roasted pecans. Oh, peaches. That's what it is. That's what it yeah, is. Yeah, yeah. You can so, definitely taste it. I think what everybody should notice out there is I don't think any of us have finished this beer. So um, let's give them credit here, though. I'm gonna give them credit. They didn't make it traditional. A traditional Christmas ale. So, very good for it. Right. Um, and maybe that's kind of what where right. our minds go. But yeah. very don't, good. Don't yeah. care for it. No. Yeah, not, not my cup of tea. Not at all. Okay. No. So we're moving on to you, uh, All right, Mr. so we are going to enjoy the um, left hand, the chai milk stout. Uh, left hand is, I think it's, man, it's, I mean, it is up there on my favorite list of breweries. Absolutely. Uh, I love all their beer. I don't, I haven't had one, even like they started doing these fruity kind of things. I had a fruity um, one last night, the Flamingo it, Dreams. Yes, yep. I, I bought the Nitro Box. Yep. Nice. And it's got a sampling of everything in there. I just love all their beer. So um, I hopefully think, milk style. you guys will I like it I well. think uh, Left Hand is one of those, like, I agree with you. Cheers. Is that a Michigan? Uh, I no, I, I think is North Carolina. No, we better look at the can. Yeah, I thought it was Col oh, Colorado. Oh, it's Colorado. Colorado, Colorado yeah. yeah. So Sorry. I put Michigan's them up there. Places. I have <laughs> two breweries. That, and again, now there's other breweries I haven't it, you know experienced enough of. I'm sure Lockport's going to be up there. But there are two breweries so far. I have not had a single beer from them that I dislike. One is Hop and Frog in Akron. Mm, I yep. love everything that I've had from Hop and Frog. Left hand is the other one. Wow. I mean, I, I love, love everything. I so love as it. I say that, I'm going to try this chai. And no one's had latte. this yet. Chai milk stout. You've had it. I I have had it. Okay. And I bought more of it. Oh, that's not what I was expecting. You know, all their beers are so smooth. They are so freaking smooth. What you think, TJ? I know this isn't in your wheelhouse. It's not my wheelhouse. Uh, but it, it's definitely smooth. It is very smooth. I'm uh, I'm getting into the porters and the and the stouts a little mm -hmm. bit more, but this is uh, this isn't bad. This is this is ridiculously smooth. It's, it really is. I mean, it's not my. So I feel like I just went to Starbucks and got a venti uh -huh. chai latte or uh -huh. something. Um, although I'd imagine this tastes a lot better than the venti yeah. chai latte, but it's not. Some, I've seen this at Eric's. And yeah, <clears throat> it's not something that I normally get. I don't dislike it. I mean, I, but I think it goes back to everything that they make is fantastic. Yeah, I got one and I tried it and I was done with it before I, I realized it. Yeah. Because it, it just, I just drank it. It doesn't, it, it, it's, it's definitely so smooth. smooth. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, it's good. It's really, really good. So, one of you guys got to go first. This is my beer. Yeah. I'll let Jimmy go first. All right, I'll go first. Um, I love everything that they have. This isn't on the top of my list, but I don't dislike it. I'm going to give this a four. I mean, if you if I was over your house, I'd have another one. Um, am I going to go out to Eric's and buy you know six pack? Uh -huh. No, but I love it. It is super smooth. It's a it's a solid four in my book. Nice. Yeah, uh, I'm going to go right in the middle of the road, middle of the score uh, of our score scale. So I'm going to go two and a half. Um, it's not my favorite. I can taste the chai a little bit. Mm -hmm. Yeah, you can definitely taste the chai. Um, so it's just I don't love that. It's not bad. Yeah. I'd have one. I wouldn't order another, but um, it's really, really smooth. I want to make sure that they mm -hmm. know that this is smooth as heck. But yeah, so I'm gonna go two and a half. 
perfect. Nice. I uh, I love it. I, I I love it. So I'm gonna give it a four and a half, um, and uh, I'm gonna get more. I'm gonna have more in my fridge because. I, it's just really good, and I like drinking it. And you and Joe, I'm going to come over to your house, and I'm going to drink one of those Sweet. beers in your fridge. So cheers. Um, let's talk about Lockport Brewery yeah. down in Bolivar, Ohio, just a short drive away from North Canton, where we are located. Um, again, I mean, I think I kind of no, talked a lot about it here when, we, when I first uh, popped it open and poured it out. So this is a peanut butter coffee porter. Again, my neighbors literally 50 feet this way, uh, you know, actually not 50 feet, maybe a little bit shorter. I can see their house. M&H um, Beans, which they're friends of ours. We've done videos with M&H Beans. Um, hopefully there's lots of collaboration we have with uh, Mike and Hannah going forward. They actually made the beans, coffee beans for this. And and I'm also going to tell you something that's it's neat. And, and I hope I'm accurate with this. And if I'm not, I hope that either Mike and Hannah, who I know watch our videos, or maybe Andrew down at Lockport can, uh, can correct me. But... You know, we're all on the uh, craft, North Canton Craft Beer Fest committee. Yes. Mike and Hannah came and brought coffee to the Craft Beer they Fest. They did, yep. And if I do remember correctly, they had a con that was when they had the conversation with Andrew from Lockport. Oh, so, in a roundabout sort of way, yes. we can, the three of us, we can helped. say that we were, yeah. no, 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 we didn't help. We were responsible for this beer. How about that? Right? I'm going to go out there and say it. we're responsible for this it's beer cool. because if it wasn't for us and, and the other people on the yep. committee, that marriage may not have happened. Nice. So with that, I give you guys. Can a I just mention one more thing before? Absolutely. Uh, Lockport is one of my favorite breweries. Yeah. Uh, they have a new location. Okay. Yeah. Uh, I mean, it's just down the street from where their old location was mm -hmm. in Bolivar. Uh, but but more than anything, uh, Andrew and his wife are like super people. Uh, oh. When when we were putting that yep. craft beer festival together, they were one of my favorite couples, and they they just they were awesome. Super nice. So I really yeah. want this beer to be good because. Yep. I like TJ, so I know you don't like the stouts and the porters. I know. You're going to like this. They have the best IPA, though, and we'll review it. I don't want to throw it out we'll, right now. Yeah, we'll get gosh, it. Gosh, it's so good. Right, we'll we'll get it. We'll, we'll, actually, maybe we should do an actual brewery review. Yeah. The three of us, we'll go down there and we'll have that IPA. Because yep. yes. I know I'm not an IPA guy, but I'll try anything he's got. So, good stuff. You got it. All right. All right. Cheers, Cheers, boys. Cheers. All right. You can definitely oh. smell the peanut butter. You can. I love it. The one thing I like about this is, you know, there are beers that you, you can, you have that you can smell like that mm -hmm. first one that we had. Um, you can smell it coming. And this one, I like it because it, it like smells smell, really it good. Sorry. Yes, it's really, really good. Yeah. I like it. I like it too. This is, well, I'm not going to rate it yet. So it's, it's my beer. I brought it to so you guys. Let me know what you think. Actually, I think I know what you think because mm -hmm. we were there at the same time. Yep. You let me know what you think. What do you like? What do you think? Again, you know, styles of beer. Are you setting this up for like a two? Because if you are, just get out. No. Okay. Um, you know, peanut butter is something I uh, don't absolutely love. So uh, take that into consideration with this. But you this, is, this, up for a two. this is better. This is better than uh, the nitro for sure. Uh, but I'll, I'd give it a three. And okay. Sit there right there. Nice. Okay. Middle road. I'd have one. Um, I'd probably. I will enjoy this. This whole yep. thing. Um, but I wouldn't have another. I would go on mm -hmm. to another beer. Okay. So, all right. I, uh, That's fair enough. Fair I'm, enough. I'm with TJ with the the peanut butter. I'm not a big peanut butter fan. Like I like peanut butter cookies, <laughs> um, but like yeah. peanut butter and jelly or I, really? I, I just no. I, I I'm not that over the top with peanut butter. I I I think it's just kind of gross. Um, I can sense where the remainder of this can is going. I, uh, <laughs> this can over here, so I I do I do like this one, you know, because I said you can smell it and it smells good mm -hmm. and it tastes good and it drinks good. Yep. Um, and it looks good. I mean, it's all it's all good. I really I really really like it. Uh, so much so that when we left, uh, Jamie and I were down there when we got that one. I got a growler. Of it to bring. I forgot home. you got a growler yep. too. Here, I, I guess maybe I, I better share this with I you. I brought it and it didn't last long. <laughs> All right. It was good and uh, I drank it. So yeah. I'm gonna I'm gonna give it a four and a half. Okay. Oh. Yeah. Oh. Okay. Yeah. I didn't know where you were going. With yeah. that. I didn't know where he was yeah. going with that oh. too. He was up. He was down. Like, he was high. No, was you know it's okay. it's the you know the it, if it's solely based on peanut butter, I'm like, but it's everything else that goes with it. Okay. Yeah. You know I can't remember. 
never hearing of another peanut butter beer. I mean, I've, I've, I love coffee stouts. I'll have coffee stouts. You know, if that was the only type of beer left for the rest of eternity, I'd be happy. I love coffee stouts, but I've never heard of a peanut butter. You know, oh, have, uh, I take that back. Peanut butter craft beer time? Do you remember when we did that? <laughs> oh, peanut yeah. Craft beer time. <laughs> yeah. Why didn't we do it for this? We should have. Oh, Can man. you bring the banana suit? Oh. Oh. I bring the banana suit. All right, next time we will have TJ wearing the banana suit doing peanut butter craft beer time. And actually, I do take that back. I guess I do remember... I remember I, I sold my one buddy on, hey, we got to get this <laughs> sweet baby Jesus oh. from Duke Law, <laughs> yeah. which is, I yeah. did not like that beer, but uh, I, so I do take it back. I do remember peanut butter beer, but um, I love this. I love the fact that, again, I joke about the fact that we are responsible for this. We are absolutely not responsible for it, but I think it is nice <laughs> that maybe we can claim this small, easy, a small, easy yeah. type of responsibility because it was... Maybe like, we made the introduction. We made, maybe we helped yep. with the introduction, but yep. I'll tell you what, I love I love uh, coffee beers. I, I love peanut butter, and I think this is an absolutely fantastic beer. I'm giving this a solid five nice. all day nice. long. Nice. I like it. In fact, next time I'm down there, I'm probably getting another crowler, which I didn't realize. That's a, that's a term. This is a can growler, a crowler. Do you know that? I did not know that. Pretty cool. So you learn something new every day. You learn that I like peanut butter craft beers, peanut yep. butter yep. peanut butter coffee beers, and that's a crowler. So No, it's super good. I yeah, love it. It is good. So. I love it. Yeah. So um are we we good here with this one? Yeah, yes. I think it was Pretty a tough critic today. Yeah, it was. I was yeah. I was I was tough on the beer. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Yeah. So um just to round this one out, just uh so you guys know, uh you can find us three guys six beers dot com. On Instagram, Facebook, uh, keep an eye out for announcements for the North Canton Craft Beer Festival. Uh, we are in the planning stages of that. Mm -hmm. uh, we have a meeting this Friday yep. to uh, keep things moving along. Tickets will go on sale for that a week before uh, Valentine's Day. So pick it up for your sweetie if you get what I'm saying. And uh, um, they go fast. So and they, they do. They do. We sold out limit. Like, yeah, <coughs> there, there's a cap. We were sold they out do six weeks fast. in advance, right? So, yes. So yeah. if you want to come, get your tickets. Yeah. So on that note, we will end this, and uh, we'll see you next time. Peace, and we out. See you guys. <laughs> All right. That's absolutely perfect time to see Matt. I saw. Him. I saw. Him. <laughs> That's why. <what laughs>